Hi, nice to meet you. In this video, I will be your guide in answering the following questions. What materials absorb water? Why? How? Hmm, it's experiment time! For this experiment, we will be needing the following materials. A sponge, cotton, paper, pencil, spoon, plastic wrapper, coin, can, tissue, face towel, and a basin of water. We will be following three steps for this experiment. First, dip a material in the basin of water. Second, press or squeeze it. And third, observe carefully and record your observation. Remember that when we say a material absorbs water, it means it takes in water. Let's start! Observe carefully. We had to squeeze the materials after dipping them to find out whether they have taken in water or not. Based from the experiment, the following materials absorb water. Sponge, cotton, paper, tissue, and face towel. Do you know why these materials absorb water? It's because all of them are porous materials. Porous materials are materials with tiny holes in them. Because of these tiny holes, air or liquid could pass through them, allowing them to take in water. There are also materials that did not absorb water. These are the pencil, plastic wrapper, coin, and can. It's because these materials are called non-porous. When we see non-porous materials, these materials do not allow air or liquid to pass through. These materials do not absorb water. Let's explore again next time. Same place, same channel.